Hello, thanks for being here. I'm John Erickson with your NBC 26 News Update. Governor Tony Evers is calling on the Wisconsin legislature to pass a package of criminal justice reforms as the state celebrates Juneteenth. However, the Democratic governor hasn't ordered a special session for the Republican-controlled legislature to take up the proposals. Assembly Democrats and the Black Legislative Caucus have requested a special session. Evers has the power to call one, as do Republican lawmakers. The call for reforms come today as Wisconsin observes the Juneteenth holiday with marches, calls for action, the raising of flags, and virtual discussions moved online due to the coronavirus pandemic. Former Republican Governor Tommy Thompson will serve as the UW system's interim president. This comes after the only finalist for the job suddenly withdrew his name from consideration. The 78-year-old Thompson is Wisconsin's only four-term governor. He stepped down during his fourth term to serve as then-president George W. Bush's health secretary. Marcus Theaters is welcoming back movie fans at a handful of theaters today. That includes several across our state, including the Valley Grand Theater in Appleton, as well as theaters in New Berlin, Greendale as well. Masks are not required for customers. Seating will be spaced out, and showtimes will be staggered with extra time between screenings to allow more time for cleaning. And here's meteorologist Gino Recchia with your forecast. It's a warm day out there. We've got temperatures in the mid and upper 80s across areas along and east of the Fox Valley. Fond du Lac got up to 90 degrees, 88 this afternoon in Green Bay. We're also monitoring a few showers and thunderstorms developing west and north of the Fox Valley. A few of these thunderstorms could eventually travel eastward into the rest of northeast Wisconsin. We've got a slow area of low pressure that's traveling eastward, and we will have the continuation of on and off showers and storms as we go into the weekend. Skycast is hitting on that. After to this afternoon and evening, the chance of rain and storms do diminish, but then as we get into our Saturday afternoon, cloud cover will be sticking around here, and we will see a redevelopment of showers and storms scattered at times during the afternoon and evening hours. And then as we go into Father's Day, we will have additional chance of a few showers and storms moving in. Now for tomorrow's chance of storms, some of which may be on the marginally severe side, that is the lowest category risk of the severe weather scale. For areas along and southwest of Green Bay, most of the southern Fox Valley out towards Watoma and Princeton could have a few stronger storms. The rest of tonight cooling down into the upper 60s with a few isolated showers and storms early, and then we should start to diminish things out. For the latest news, weather, and sports, download that NBC26 app. It is free on the App Store. Have a good one.